What's up ladies and gentlemen, it's Sarcasm back again with another video. Hope you guys are having a great Monday. Before we jump into the game we are playing today, we have to announce our winner, winner chicken dinner for this month's shout out. Now uh, I put a bunch of names, every single person that had commented on a video this last month on one of my uh, videos put them into a random name chooser over at wheelsofnames.com and our winner is rockstarpool69 now this guy is a pretty awesome dude he does a lot for a lot of people he also streams I think it's anywhere from two to three times almost every single day it feels like uh, he plays a few games like Jurassic World, Bus Simulator, Train Sim World, and then my personal favorite is his F1 car series stuff that he has going on. He has some amazing commentary, something that I've liked about him from the very get-go. Been a fan of his channel for quite a long time. Uh, you know, you go and watch one of those F1 or racing videos of any kind. He does an amazing commentary that makes you feel like you're at a race. And I think that's pretty awesome. I mean, go subscribe to him. You know, go watch his videos. Go check him out if you haven't already. And uh, we're going to jump into the video a little bit more uh, Canarium, episode 3. And uh, don't forget, if you want to be entered into this monthly shout out for October, make sure you comment on a video this month. All right, so in the last episode, we were running from something that happened over there. And uh, basically opened a coffin or something like that. And then a ghost or something appeared. But if I recall, we got the thing, yeah. So we got the wheel we needed for this. Let's go ahead and turn it. I mean, I don't know exactly what it just changed. Looks like something's missing here. Okay, so there's still something I'm missing. Does this pressure plate do anything yet? You know. Yeah, I bet this probably like slides out of the way or something. Uh, just want to make sure there's nothing I'm missing here. All right, so let's go back to where the ghost was, I guess, and see if there was anything there. guy's still there okay yeah let's open more oh wait read the description an ornamental metallic object with an elder sign a sign used for protection from powerful entities Carved on one of the faces. Yeah, we will take that. Make sure nothing else is popping up. Hello? Anybody in there? No. Anything? Nothing at all, dang it. What's up these stairs? Uh, 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 the same set of symbols we've seen in strangely carved pictures uh, all around here matches with what is written in the oldest parchment. I believe uncertainly that they represent a destination towards somewhere significant. Interesting. So according to that guy, these are 
destinations of some sort. Seen a vision near the rock tablet in a place that looked somewhat like an ancient burial ground. There was a diaphragm consisting of several glyphs carved on the rock's polished surface. And one glyph in particular was mentioned by the silhouette that appeared in the vision. Copy down the diagram and mark that glyph. Okay. Oh, there's more uh, coffin type things. Nice. Let's open them all. <laughs> Let's go see if this does anything for us. Place it here. I need something. I need to figure out what is needed. Where did the thing go? <clears throat> Looks like I'm missing something. Still don't entirely know what I'm missing there. That might be what I needed. Let's go find out. Five pieces of stone with different glyphs on them. Hmm. Sounds a little familiar. Bingo. Oh, God. I'm going to have to go and look at what the top... Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay, so... Let's see if I can do this in one try. Alright, wish me luck. Probably gonna have to run back. Okay, so this one goes there. This one goes there. This one goes there. Goes there. This one goes there. Yes. Well, I don't know. Hey, we did it. Maybe. Super surprised with myself. I didn't think I was going to get that the first try. I was totally expecting something to jump out too. Still am. Especially because it just saved. You guys saw that, right? So that's what I look like. Hmm. 
for a moment, I thought my reflection in the mirror was about to talk to me. For a moment, I, I felt a strange crawling sensation in my wrists when I touched this black mirrored surface, and I thought I saw a, a light glowing on my forehead. For a moment, I thought my oh, reflection okay. in the mirror was about to talk to me. It probably was, Buckaroo. It was probably going to tell you to get the heck out of here. You know, I bet that blizzard's probably done. Frank, can you hear me? Yeah, that's pretty clear. Oh, thank God. Yes, I can hear you. Finally. It seems the effect of the mix just starts to wear off. Frank, heed me carefully. Time is running out, so I must be brief. Where exactly are you? Dr. Faust, is that you? I'm inside the caves below the base. Where are you? Listen, I cannot talk much. I know that you are having trouble remembering, but you must keep going. Use one of the submarines and follow the light. Okay. If you say so. Do you hear me? Come on, please. Where are you? Damn it. The connection is lost. He said I have to keep going. Why? Where are they? Another one of those statues. A couple of them. Those bat wings. <laughs> I've got a bad feeling. totally get into this submarine no I don't want to get into it but the guy told us we had to so it's time Driving a submarine. I mean, it's kind of neat that I'm in control of this. Said to follow the lights, huh? What happens if I hit something? wondering what that noise is that's me whenever I'm slowing down or uh, speeding it up.
Is that another light? It's hard to see. It's pretty murky. I fit through there? We're gonna find out, aren't we? Well... <laughs> um, so that's back the way we came. Okay, so we can't go up anymore. Can we fit through this right here? Totally risking it. going on again. Uh. Well, that didn't sound very good, did it? to the end. Well, I thought I was already going as fast as I could. <laughs> oh no, it's leaking. to go that way. Full speed ahead! Let's get this jellyfish looking thing with our already damaged submarine which means we're probably gonna die. <laughs> I'm real optimistic, aren't I? <laughs> Just leave me alone, jellyfish. Squid, whatever it is. It's probably a squid, honestly, now that I think about it. It's got me! 
me! No! 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 Yikes. Wait a second. I'm back at the base, aren't I? pitch black out there. Okay. Well. Interesting. So we're going through the pathways that we unlocked or that they were talking about. Where, where am I? How did I get here? When? Interesting. I am liking this game. Expedition parties. Is there anyone who can read me? One person is dead, and two others have been injured by the partial ice cave collapse. Uh oh. There is something here with us. Do not come through our expedition route. I repeat, do not come through our expedition route. Yes, I read you. This is Frank. For God's sake, what happened? And please, tell me where I can find you. Frank, do not stray from your path. We have come across something... terrible. Do not come here through our expedition route, no matter what happens. It looks like this fiendish netherworld. Depends on some kind of energy. An energy that is stored in curious stoneworks similar to an obelisk with crystals on top. And they are able to clear away some of the strange plants. Interesting. Dr. Faust? Dr. Faust? Oh, come on, not again! This is nonsense. I cannot understand what is going on. And neither can I, but maybe in the next episode, we will find out what's truly going on. I think we are getting pretty close to uh, 
figuring that out. So, if you guys are enjoying this series, let me know down below. Click on that subscribe button if you want to see more. And, you know, while you're at it, give me that thumbs up while you're down there next to that subscribe button. Uh, and I will see you guys on Wednesday. 